Looking for a spooktacular time this Halloween season? Well, the place to go may be just to our South Sea World's Howl of Scream is back. Joining me this afternoon, obviously, here is Jack O' Lantern. Well, and hello. unfortunately, some of the spooky creatures, ah. but they're they're okay right now. So tell me a little bit about what all's going on at SeaWorld. Yes, right now. well, we have so much do it happening at SeaWorld. It's amazing. Now, of course, we have creepy crawlies, we have shows, we have all sorts of animals and whatnots. Now our shows. Let's talk about that for a minute. We have Jack is Back. It's revamped. Brand new this year. We have a new Shemu's Rockin' Creep show. <laughs> we have Monster Stomp. We have uh, a, a show of sea lions. A new sea lion show. It's Clyde and Seymour's Monster Mix-Up. Now, there's so many things going on, but of course we have to introduce the I creepy. I know. Problems. I was like, I wish you would have brought Shamu, but instead ah. we've got... All right. What well, it's a little hard to get Shamu here to yeah, Austin, but we brought some of our, our creepy creatures. This is Elaine, and Elaine is a Florida king snake. And Angie, mm -hmm. what are the things they eat? Rattlesnakes. Okay, they get rid of the bad guys. They do. They, they, what they do is they strike back. Not that rattlesnakes are bad because they also play an important role, but the rattlesnake will strike out at the king snake. The king snake will then strike out simultaneously at the, rats, or the rattlesnake and swallow okay. them a whole and live and help digest them. They also eat rats and mice. Okay. Uh, and in, right in front of us here, we also yeah. have a Chilean a little fuzzy guy. tarantula. Yeah. Yes, this is Cena. And I know it's hard to see this animal uh, because they're so well camouflaged. Mm -hmm. These animals come from South America. And in their natural environment, if they get scared, they'll rub their back legs against the uh -huh. back of their body. Hairs will go into the air and up the nostrils or whatever's bothering them. Okay. Now, d does he hasn't moved much. Is he okay? You know what? We work a lot with Cena and Elaine. They're part of our animal ambassador okay. team. We're able to travel around here to Austin yeah. and other places in the state of Texas to talk about animals and conservation. Each of these animals is important for the environment. And you can find both of these at the Animal Connections Conservation Center. And unfortunately, though, during Halloween, Jack's Sea Oddity ah. Sideshow is our next door neighbor. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Our scare zone spans from Shamu all the way to the Steel Eel. Now, in there, you'll find my Sea Oddity Sideshow, what Clay was talking about, and sword swallowers, mm -hmm. mind readers, mm -hmm. and all sorts of scary creatures. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds a little creepy. Oh, yes. Can we bring this? Oh, yes, of course we can. I know. This I is a nocturnal this. species next to Jack. Okay. This is a bar. Now, look at that. Can you hear anything, <laughs> you hear anything Angie, at all? You see that? Okay, they have no. silent <laughs> flight. They have little ridges on the edges of their feathers, yeah. which they use to move air through their feathers. You've backed up so okay? much. I don't know where you're going. <laughs> the, air know. Travels, <laughs> the air travels through their feathers and makes silent flight so they can find rats and mice easier. Okay. Now, because this animal's nocturnal, her big eyes help her to bring in as much light as possible. Actually, if you had eyes the size of owls, mm -hmm. you had eyes the size of grapefruits in your head. Head. Can you imagine that? Gross. Yeah. Her okay. eyes are so big she can't do this. She can't turn them side to side. So she rotates uh -huh. her head and she can rotate her head up to 270 degrees. Mm -hmm. Now nocturnal animals, they know our scare zones and our Halloween, uh, at Hollow Scream at SeaWorld better than anyone. Uh -huh. But during the day we have all kinds of fun stuff for the kiddos. They okay. can come to Count Von Count's un uh, Unhaunted Castle. Count one counts, count down the Halloween. They can trick or treat at Fantasy. And families have a very affordable way of coming to SeaWorld this year. Okay. Right now we have a special promotion. If you purchase a fall fun card, mm -hmm. you get the rest of 2012, all of 2013, all the way through the beginning of 2014, that families can come out and enjoy all of our events at SeaWorld, our conservation, our education. But most importantly, come out Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, <laughs> all the way through October 20th. Yes. Someone's excited. Oh, she, she knows SeaWorld <laughs> right is a here. hoot. Right. <laughs> all right, and yeah, Hello Scream continues through the end of the month at SeaWorld in San Antonio. Thank you, Jack O'Lantern and Mark, and for bringing all of your little creepy crawly friends for us today. Thank you. We appreciate it.